Hello everyone, once you've logged on to Learning Genie, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to apply the privacy filter. The first place you're going to need to go is the roster tab, which is the green tab on the left hand side of the screen. Once you go on the roster tab, you can just choose a child that you want to apply the privacy filter for. So I'm going to choose Zelda. Once I click on Zelda's picture, it'll take me to the edit child page where I can turn on this no photo consent from parents and that will put a banner on Zelda's picture. Once you're done, you're going to click on the check mark in the right hand corner of the screen to save. And then once you've applied the privacy filter, you'll see in the class in the roster page, the banner on the picture of the child that you've turned this privacy filter on for. Then you can go to the engagement tab where we can add a activity for this child. And the way to add the activity is you click on the plus sign in the right hand corner of the screen. Then you click on the activity feature where you can put an activity description. I'll put the children made Lego buildings. Okay. And then you can also add a photo for this activity. I'm going to use the blue icon to pull a photo from my photo album. So I'm going to choose this photo right here. And then to save the photo, click on the check mark, then done. And then now that you've added the photo, you have the, the observational information, so that the description, you can add the families as well. And once you add the families, you can click on the check mark. And then you'll have a pop up where you can apply the privacy filter. So I'm going to apply the privacy filter. And once you click on apply privacy filter, you can then blur out the child's face whose parents want privacy for the child and whose no photo consent was turned on for their profile. And then you can also add stickers if you'd like to make it a little bit more entertaining. Then you click on the check mark to save, click anywhere on the picture to actually save it again. And then to finalize it, click on the check mark again in the right hand corner. And then you can see on Zelda's page where the privacy filter was turned on, their photo is not edited. So the parents are not seeing an edited photo. But now if you go to Kate Middleton's picture, this picture is edited. That is how you can apply a privacy filter.